We will be seeking an adjournment, which is a bigger period of time to respond to the injunction. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what we'll be seeking tomorrow morning. The City of Vancouver has indicated that in response to that, they will be seeking an interim injunction that would come into effect during the adjournment of the original injunction that would be on the basis of the fire bylaws. So that's what will be happening in court tomorrow morning. Absolutely nothing is going to go on between now and then. So have a wonderful, lovely, peaceful night. Beautiful Occupy Vancouver. That's 
what I am as a clan mother of this very land, this unseen territory of BC. This fire is a sacred fire, and we're going to do it one more, one more today, and we'll see how things turn out. If things turn out, and people come together, regardless of their mayors or police, whatever, I hope this changed everyone's mind last night about how things are being being done in this day and age. And I'm so sad to see that this went on like that. But I hope things turn out much better than, than um, what we see in, around the world. We're not here for um, fighting back and arguing back and forth. We're here to make a universal declaration for Mother Earth's protection for our future, your kids' future. The fire is going now. And it, I'm so glad to see this pole go up again today one more time. that this prayer reaches everyone's heart regardless of who you are. Circle, make a circle here. Make a circle this way and around the fire. For all of you that have never seen this kind of fire in the city, I haven't either. Make the circle, come out, come out, away from the fire. come up to me and they're, they're lost, they're hungry, they're homeless, they have no mom and dad, I was told. What is it that this world has come to that some parents of these kids don't care anymore who their kids are? I adopted a lot of kids in the last few days here and it's made me feel better because I know that I make a difference in someone's life. And I don't take that for granted. And I hope you don't either. Adopt somebody, regardless of who it is. Love somebody, hug somebody. This is a prayer now to the Creator. And thank you, Creator, for this good day today. Another day that we, we stood up and fought back and had our say. The fire is the most sacred one of all elements. And without the fire, we wouldn't be here today. And it just sounds so good from here, the sparkling. Thank you, Creator, for this good day. Put your hands on our enemies so that they will learn from the, what they did. Learn from um, their bad moves. I was told last night it, it was like a chess game. This is, our life is not a chess game. 
You need to put your hand on those people out there that are in power, that we put into power for them to, to look after us, not to hinder us and make us enemies. As enemies, if we are enemies, that we pray for them. We make them stronger through our prayers that they will understand that what they did last night was not right under any laws, natural law, international law for us as indigenous people because we are practicing our religious right that they snuffed out 50 years ago so that they could make us Catholic, Protestants, or United Church. We are not one of them. We are back to where we've been in thousands and thousands of years. Without us, they wouldn't be alive today because, because of us living this long, we made it. Will you make it as human beings? Will you make it without us? I ask the Creator to help us to every step of the way from here on. For what I teach to people is that peace and love is better than war. And that we want to make a change. Everyone, all the leaders of the world talk about change, but they, with their word change, it's just fair change in their pocket now. They need to deal with all those leaders because they need to be back to earth to where, the people, where they belong with us as human beings. Protect this sacred fire and with this fire I, I pray for the enemies that want to be enemies. But you're welcome to be our friend. Just join us. That's all you need to do.
Thank you for all your time and helping us.